hello. So I wanted to do a day in my life at Scab Lacoste because I've done a few for Savannah and people seem to like them. People seem to get a lot of info from them. So I wanted to do a Scab Lacoste one for people who were coming to Lacoste and don't really know what to expect, like how similar and different it is from Savannah. So I'm actually doing like two days in my life. You know, like Savannah, it's on the Monday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Thursday time schedule. I am gonna make another video after I'm done with my semester and done with my experience of like tips and tricks and just like things that are really important to know about Lacoste. I've been compiling a list, but I wanna wait until the semester is done so that you guys have like all the info that you could need. It's like 9.45, so I'm gonna stop talking now and actually get started with my day because I have a shit ton to do. It's week, I don't even know what week it is, like what number week it is, because like this entire experience has been such a blur, but I'm close to the end. I'm pretty close to the end. I have like two and a half more weeks left, so whatever that makes it. One thing that I did want to note is that I'm in Brady's room right now. I'm not actually in my room, which is not really an important factor for me getting ready right now because I brought all my stuff, but all the rooms are different, which I will talk about more like in my other video, but all my skincare products are from Very Good Light because I'm interning with them and they sent me like a bunch of stuff. So that's something else you'll see with me today is that I'm interning. Like I have an internship going on right now too, but I highly recommend Good Light skincare. It's so good. They're not even paying me to do this. I just genuinely <laughs> think it's so good. They have like a like five step routine or something, but highly recommend. Good Light, if you wanna sponsor me after I'm done my internship, that would be pretty cool. Um, you know, if you wanted to just like keep sending me stuff because you just love me so much. Um, what's actually funny is that I'm the person in charge of <laughs> recruiting people who post like this to send them more, more stuff. So maybe I'll just put myself on the list. <laughs> this product, is literally like the best. It like dries out your pimples and helps them like heal faster. But it's been really cold. It's fall, it's the end of October. This weekend is Halloween. I'm from the North, I'm from Pennsylvania. So I know what cold feels like. Like I lived it for a very long time. Um, I literally live in the mountains in Pennsylvania too. So I know, I know what cold is, but Obviously, I've been living in Georgia for a couple of years because I'm a junior now. So I kind of forgot what fall feels like. And it's much colder than I remember after living in Georgia. And also, all the classrooms here are like still kind of cold and like people leave the windows open a lot. So I'm like layering up right now because I know it's cold out. It's like not even 60 degrees. So bring layers. And if you're coming in the fall, you need to know, I'm gonna say this in my next video, you need to know that it is hot as fuck when you first get here and it's freezing cold by the end. And one night it literally just switches and you're never gonna see it coming. But all of a sudden you stop wearing tank tops and skirts and you are wearing sweaters and pants and boots every day. Okay, I'm done getting ready. I'm done getting ready and now I'm going to the library to go crank out some work before lunch. Look at this view. So good. I literally forgot my computer. <laughs> okay, moving on. Grind time. It's like 10, 15, lunch is at 12. I'll probably work for like an hour and a half. So, see you around 11.30.
so it's like 11 30 almost and i've done all i can do right now because brady needs to help me fix my storage situation on my computer so i'm gonna go drop off my bag and say hi to my roommates Fixing my baby. Back to the library to go do more homework. One thing that I should probably say is that we have like very designated meal times. So lunch is from 12 to 1 every day, except for Saturdays and Sundays, and then it's 11 to 1 because it's like brunch. And breakfast is 8 to 9 a.m. every day except for Saturdays and Sundays. And then dinner is 6.30 to 8 every day. And like the cafeteria is not open other than that. Like it's not like in Savannah where it's like open all the time and they have like, like an hour break. Like those are the only times you get food. <laughs> Time for din din. This is a day in Maya's life. Yeah, we covered that part already. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm late to this one. <laughs> Packing. You always start like that. <laughs> With that pose. That's my, it's my go-to. Morning vlog. <laughs> Good morning. It's like 8.30 and I have to get ready for class because I have class at 9. We don't have 8 a.m. here, we have 9 a.m. So I have a 9 a.m. and I have class at 1. Head into class. done with my first class it's noon because our class goes from 9 to 12 so we're about to go to lunch i finished my class i actually have so much to do before i leave tomorrow for our trip so it's gonna be a chaotic afternoon Okay, so I'm now in the Thursday afternoon prep before I leave for another country mode. But this is always like, I feel like everyone in my house is always running around like doing this kind of stuff on a Thursday or like sometimes even Wednesdays because sometimes we leave on Thursdays after class. So like Thursday afternoons are usually like, Pretty chaotic. Dinner time! Hey. Oh. You look like a squirrel. <laughs> that is a lot of seasoning. And? I put four little packs of pepper in it, and all of a sudden, uh, it's too spicy. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> like reverse uh, like literally. Uh, <laughs> dude, make make that rice the not fucking dry shit. <laughs> <laughs> forgot to wrap up my day last week but 
after I went and hung out with my friends, we just kind of finished packing and went to bed and got ready for the next day. So that was two days of my life at Scad Lacoste. I hope you guys were able to learn something from this video and stay tuned because I will post more informative videos about Scad Lacoste, things you need to know before you come, a recap of my quarter, things like that. Okay. Bye guys. <laughs>